welcome to the Master Wong TV. You know, finish now, Christmas is gone. I don't know about you not, but over Christmas, I eat a little bit, little bit uh, too much. So this year, it's going to be work a little bit harder to get older, you know, a little bit fat out. But as you know, me, I training all the time, so, so right. But for some people, there's stuff like my personal trainer, people train with me, there's stuff, so many shit on them. They come back with a couple of stone on. I said, you're going to work so hard to get rid of all the shit you put on. You see, this is what happened that Christmas do for you. Relax too much, too much food, too much eating, and that's what happened. But New Year coming up. If anyone out there need to do something for themselves, get themselves fitter, stronger, get themselves into martial art, do something about it, then you need to get on with it. Because this year, I tell you what, going to disappear so quick that your mum won't able to know about. So this is why it's important. If you got any question to ask me, you know where to go. Go to the one and only the Master Wong TV and ask the master and he will talk to you about. But let's get on with it. Let's see what we have here for the show today. Today, we got someone called Kim. Is it Ken? Kin. Kin, where he from? He from nowhere. He didn't tell me where he from. So what he's saying to me is, getting a bit high tech now, you know. What he's saying to me is, as uh, remember the first, the, uh, last year, I read out one of the comments, but the English is not too good, so I probably fuck it up. Something to do with lean or not lean or something. I, I'll come back with that question later on, but uh, that's the problem, man. When you can't read, you can't flipping read. And this is why I try my best to do it as best that I can. Because I can't read, man. Okay then, see what he's saying. Mm. Hello, Master Wong. Firstly, a big thank you for all the highest quality training video you have put on up on YouTube. That's all right. We do that all the time. Better to have some good high quality. If you put crap up there, no one will look at you. So it must be high quality. Even you give things away. Keep the good shit. Don't give them shit of the shit. People don't want that. And then what he's saying is, there are no Wing Chun school or teacher. They're saying it's, it's only because of your clips that I have been able to start learning Wing Chun. That's good. At least you're looking for something and then you want to join. You're looking for it, it's right in your doorstep if you know where to look. Okay, he write a lot, but I just try to wrap on a bit and see what he's saying. I like the way you teach, especially when you say, if something works for you, use it. Of course, what are we living in? 21st flipping century. We're not living in stone age, your thumb, your thick. You have to do it that way. You got to put your hand up this way. You move that way. You do this way. You're prophetic. It may be work for you, but it don't work for anyone else's. Everything I do, when I'm teaching, so many people I teach, Depend on the personal trainer side, each person have got to teach them a different way. Because they are pick up a different way, they learn a different way. Each position with a the hand, they're using different ways. Some of them, it works for them, and some of them don't work for the other person. Why? Because sometimes you're big and strong. So that movement might be suitable for you. But in fortune, you're skinny, and you've got bone on you, and you're weak. It's that work. The moment didn't work for you. So you have to understand this. Most of the people out there teaching, they won't know anything about each person learn different things. That is it. This is the, the, the goddamn uh, piece of crap go and do something about it. The dumb understanding is that piece of crap may be useful for someone because they can neutronize that crap. And some people, even you give the good shit to them, they don't able to neutronize that particular movement, the, 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 the information to give them. So you have to give them something else. And this is important. Same thing like eating. You can't eat so many shit. Someone said, I'm hungry a lot today. I shoved so many crap on me and I tried to make it, uh, it's good. But reality term is, it's not flipping good, you know. You take loads of crap onto you. This doesn't mean you can digest them. It just means that just stay on your body and then you get big and fat and ugly. And that can be bad news. Okay, let's get on with it. Fucking I'm rapping a lot because Christmas, I'm quite happy, you know. Why? I don't know. I'm just happy. Okay then, what he's saying is, usually martial art teachers are very strict 
and do not open mind and experience a student to follow their way blindly without question. I know this is the problem. That's why the master won't here to help you. But of course, many assholes out there say the same thing. I'm there just trying to doing this, doing that, and try to brainwash people. You see, one person saying good thing, another person saying a bad thing. I don't know what you believe. I don't know what you believe. You believe whatever you want to believe. Who cares? I don't bloody care what you believe. It don't bother me at all what you believe. It's you, your life to deal with, not mine. I don't care how you would believe and what you believe. What are we saying? I put some left for you not to read. Flipping long, man. I like the way you tip, ba 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 ba, uh, show you the different way of uh, fighting. Of course, you need to do so because you don't understand different way of fighting. You won't be able to fight, and then you're gonna have problem. And when you come to a tent, and then somebody else zap you, and you don't know how to fight with them, you're in a shit. So you gotta know a different way to do so. And what are we saying here? Okay, this uh, man. If I read along, would be fucking hell, man. Christmas, next Christmas, haven't finished. And finally, get to the question, yeah. I have a question for you, Master Wong. What the hell you got for me? Let's see. When a person is young, you are training and relax and is using speed and stretching and it help, uh, helps them to fight well. But when you're growing older, ability is uh, decreased because you're old. Of course you're old. Your, your muscle can't be functional properly and you're in a ship. So what happened is, uh, how you gonna different plan uh, to when you are young? What are you view on this? What's your view on this? Is there any special way of training blah, 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 helping you in the Wing Chun when you're older, when you're going old? If so, what is the advice? Look forward to hurt from you. Regard Ken. I don't know how old you are. I don't know what you do. Reality tell me you have to understand the basic simple thing. The basic simple simple thing is very simple. You have to do the basic well. If you do the basic well, then what happening is when your body is quite good and uh, understanding all the muscle, all the joint, and when you're older, you can exercise that particular part of the muscle without uh, breaking and performing. But of course, when you're older, you need to be wiser, you need to be more clever, so you don't go in there and hit your fast movement and hitting punching. You know you don't do that. You're doing completely something else. Wing Chun, can you use it when you're old? Ah, reality terms, you ask everybody. Old you are, you cannot use, really use Wing Chun. You've got to be understanding how to use your body to against your opponent. So everything you need to understand is, when they come at you, you're using their body against them. I prefer using a lot of Tai Chi when they're getting old, because Tai Chi is easy to perform and keep it on, on, on you. But of course, when you practice when you're older, you need to spend longer time doing more lightly doing a Tai Chi movement than Wing Chun because Wing Chun is more fast and it's easy to join it mess up. And if you do using Wing Chun because you've got nothing else to do, fucking hell, I talk a lot, man. Oh, shit, need some water first, huh? And then what you do is when you have um, some time, you got need to make sure all the movement of your body can... Uh, Strong first, or the joint strong first. Otherwise, you move too fast, you can hurt your back, hurt your joint, mess up your knee, mess up all your joint. Then definitely you're in a real shit. So my advice is, if you're young, you spend some time to get a good basic. If you're old, then you got to make sure that you spend some time and do it slowly. Otherwise, you're gonna get hurt bad. That's all we got today. Time's up, people. Let's see what we got here uh, for you. Uh, this one is um, Ken, yeah? Go to the Master Wong TV and claim your free download. So make sure you do so. And this one here is people from YouTube that subscribe to the Master Wong TV. You not only uh, subscribe to Master Wong TV on YouTube, yeah? This one here called... Uh, no idea. Subscribe, uh, Ninki, fuck it up, Ninti, zero nine, no idea. I written down here, you got to make sure the name is right and then claim your free download. Now, everybody know, know when you got a question, do you know where to find me? Only one and only the Master Wong on YouTube. Go to the Master Wong TV and then write in and ask me anything, whatever you want to ask me, and be here and then answer the question and give you the free download. And that's all we got for you today. So, see you Lala. Bye.